Hi, so today we're headed to Mitchell Bay to pick up our 2014 Gulfstream toy hauler, 17 feet. Uh, we're going to see how it looks. So we looked at it on Kijiji. Um, it was close to what we were expecting layout wise. So we put a deposit down. Now we're going to go check it out and pick it up. And there's Skanda all excited about his uh, toy hauler. Two boys um, that's joining us who will use the toy hauler the most, a lot more than us. Uh, we're going to be using it for dirt biking. I hope it looks nice because we need space to sleep and for our dirt bikes. Yep, and we should be able to warm up our food and keep ourselves warm or cold based on the weather. So let's see how this toy hauler looks, eh guys? So as you can see, we are reversing onto the driveway and we see the trailer. We have not got down to check it out as of yet. Let's go check it out. Okay, put it in the bottom. So as you can see, we are here. We've picked up the trailer. We've uh, pulled over, parked it. So I can give you a, a tour of uh, how the toy hauler looks. Um, let's get started. So this is, once again, the 2014 Gulfstream Track and Trail 17 RTH. Um, I will show you the model right here. Here it is. It's the Gulfstream. Stop it, Trina. It's a recreational vehicle, of course, and it's Gulfstream 17 RTH. There you go, I found it. <laughs> So I'll just show you outside how it looks. Here's the awning and my son's already inside. He's got the inside opened and the lights turned on. So here, this is the ramp to put your toys in, of course, once you open it up. You have to do a tour of, it's opened with toys inside once we have it home and have the dirt bikes inside. But this is how it looks outside. This is in really good condition it's um, three years old right now and we're going to have some great time with it we right now we have a teardrop so which is a lot smaller there's no room for anything except a queen mattress so this is a huge upgrade for us the boys uh, seem to be very excited about this new travel home of ours here we're inside the trailer right now and we're in the kitchen so it's got white, double sink, the faucet, nice windows there, and the two stove, two burners. Here's the hot water and turn on button over there. Lots of cabinets as you can see. Cabinets down here, drawers over there. That's the doorway into the bathroom. Here's the fridge. It's a dual fridge, I believe. It functions on gas and propane. So you can set it up to auto uh, if you would like it to automatically switch to whatever power source is available. Here's another cabinet. And that's the furnace, I believe. Yeah. With more cabinets. So let's get into the bathroom. Here we have our nice... Uh, stand-up shower and here we've got the unit to do your personal business we however do not have a pedestal sink um, to brush your teeth and that sort of stuff but that can be done in the kitchen sink which is right over here or of course you can use the shower to brush and wash up Here's my son's face when I mentioned that. <laughs> Here's my other son hiding his face inside. So Skanda has already had the full inspection. However, he is doing further inspections. Here's the double. Um, this opens up into a couch and or it can open up into a double bed. And we've got another double bed slash couch over here. And here is the queen um, bed up at the top. Um, so Jaden can demonstrate to us what which side needs to be pulled first. First, take the lock 
locks out on both sides and then you don't pull this side first you pull that side after you pull this side that side you then you pull this side and then it'll be up to here the bed comes down and there's lots of headroom um, we haven't decided who's going to take the queen bed space, but Skanda and I were discussing we were going to take over the um, queen bed space no, and no. the boys were going to have their own double beds, but Jaden keeps insisting he wants the queen bed space. Look, there goes my wonderful other half trying to demonstrate the bed coming down. Woo! There we go. So there, he's made the extra effort to show you guys how that looks. Up, in order to get up, you can either fly a ladder or you can just jump up. Please demonstrate the jumping up. I would like to see. Whoa, that's gonna take you. So I'm 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 very thrilled. I really like this. It's small yet big we're enough for us. The queen bed, so we can have a better look of the area. And I believe and someone comes and tries to steal something. We still away. haven't figured out we're gonna have where we're gonna have the TV. However, I was suggesting to Scanda the TV should go there. And no. with the brackets that pops the TV, brings the TV, TV. out here. TV, yeah, it should be over there, here. and then it pops out to over here. So then, so we can stay by the bed over there and watch the TV over here. Yeah, that's good. And you know, wouldn't it be ideal you park your RV in a spot like this and you open the door and there's lake water. This is ideal location. So that's the So that's the tour of our 2014 Gulf Stream Track and Trail 17 RTH. I hope you really enjoyed watching this um, tour. As, as much as I enjoyed giving it to you guys. So that's the tour of our 2014 Gulf Stream. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Please uh, like and subscribe to our videos and our YouTube channel.